Greetings, Poke fans! Michael here! And what is up, guys? This is John, aka Pokemon. And welcome to episode 23 of our Pokemon Black and White Metronome Randomizer Nuzlocke. If you have been enjoying the series, don't forget to hit that like button, make sure you answer the comment question, and make sure you check out the last episode over on Pokemon's channel, so you know what the boot is going on! Mike, when did you come up with that saying? I think I just said it randomly, like a couple <laughs> like I think I started it in like Insurgents. Like I think that was the oh, okay. first time I said it on camera. Um, I want to know if there was just some like greater story uh, where with if you want to know what the booty is going on. No, it's just like I, I, I've said booty a lot because I like that word, you know. Like I'm, <laughs> I much prefer booty to butt. You know, it's just like you're getting our booties kicked is a lot more fun to say. Like we're getting our butts kicked. You know what I mean? I, I too prefer goofy words. Go on. But yeah, so oh, John, uh, the first gym trainers Pokemon. They only have one. Is level 41. So, we may be a little bit underleveled for this, but it's fine. I, and I'm pretty sure, I, I'll look again, but I'm like very confident I looked gym, black and white. Uh, there it is. And it goes scroll, 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 scroll. 41, 41, 43, so we shouldn't be underleveled. I mean, mine are all 40, what are yours? Uh, 40. Ah, fair enough. I mean like, he's gonna have one Pokemon that's a higher level than ours. Fair enough. But, I mean. I think we should be fine. Mm -hmm. banana, banana. Well, I also have one Pokemon that's super overleveled because I just want my stupid Matang to finally evolve. Oh yeah! Because <laughs> I have crazy. Multiple... You're still gonna be a Matang by the time you beat the eighth gym. Well, no, he's one level away from evolving because he has the experience share on. So the rest of my Pokemon aren't getting as much experience, but Matang is I at see. level 44. So. I have three Pokemon that aren't fully evolved, so I don't care if one of them's overleveled. I just want it to evolve. I deserve this. Oh my god, you gotta be kidding me. That sucks, dude. The Altaria, I've disabled its metronome. It kills itself with struggle recoil this turn, but I outspeed and use Healing Wish. I, uh, I know the feel. It's not a good one. <laughs> I'm sorry to hear it. Oh my god, that's so frustrating. That did not need to happen. That Actually, need Mike, when, happen. Are you, when do you upload this? I'm planning to upload this on Monday, April M -m 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 23rd. Monday. Oh, episode 23 on the 23rd, huh? That's right, well, funny. uh... Sp 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 spoiler, and if, actually, if you guys are not already watching me and Mikey and everyone else's battles in the Metronome League, you definitely should do that, but <laughs> that's that's how I lost my battle this week. <laughs> yeah, that was, uh... <laughs> I, like, I still can't believe it. it. It's one of those things, like, you know when you're like, alright, so the only way this could go terribly is if this one thing up oh, there happened. <laughs> like, I still remember, like, GBA Season 4... I played against someone, and the only way they could beat me, like, I did, I demolished them all battle. Like, I was just absolutely crushing them. And the only way they could beat me is if they got a crit with their Moxie Pokemon, and then they'd obviously be able to Moxie boost and beat me. Otherwise, there was no other scenario where they even had a chance to beat me. And it's like, Pokemon, you're a cruel game. Dude, you're, like, making me want to throw up, and I didn't even experience that. It, it was it was a sad time. I still still made the playoffs. It didn't ruin. It got close to ruining the season and making it so I didn't make playoffs. <laughs> but yeah, I'm I'm just I'm sad, you know, because it's like so. For context, guys, the Metronome Battle Federation. Which, if you're not watching those videos, you should because the battle. I'm pretty sure so last week had three crazy battles. Yeah. Um. Last week, so you're you're seeing this the Monday after the week two battles have gone live. We are recording this prior to the week two battles going live. Um, so just like keep that in mind. Um, but the, I think of the three battles that occurred, every single one was a 1-0 or less. No, or a 0-0. Oh. <laughs> yeah, because John lost 0-0 zero, zero <laughs> because his last Pokemon self-destructed. And if your last Pokemon uses self-destruct, apparently you lose because you yeah. blow yourself up die, and then the shockwave hits the opponent and kills them. 
So yep. <laughs> it was it was ridiculous. I I had a very soul crushing loss. Yeah. You know, because I was up like I, I at one point I was up six two. I had not lost a single Pokemon, and he had two left, and I lost because Toxic Spikes just overwhelmed my entire team. Um, Toxic Spikes is very broken in our Metronome League because you yes. can't. Uh, the, there's only one Poison type in the entire draft, and John has it. Um, I'm really wishing I had picked Gengar instead of Dusk Noir, but that Gengar was... is going to be the first pick if we ever do this again. Now, uh, yeah, because it has yeah, first it body and poison. Yeah, it's. I mean, its frailty is bad, but like I didn't. No, I don't think anybody really even considered the the toxic spike situation. But yeah, regardless, yeah. I am now last place in the league that I started. I have no. I'm the only person who doesn't have a single win. And it, it it burns, John. It burns. <laughs> you might have a better differential than Matt because he lost. No, I, I, well, we have equal differentials. Which I think is ridiculous. Yeah, it's... Metronome is a cruel mistress. <laughs> yeah. It's... Like, the thing... <laughs> like, Toxic Spikes beat you, and I should have won because I got Toxic Spikes. So, Matt, I got Toxic Spikes, and he immediately had two Pokemon in a row both kill themselves. And I'm like, oh... There's no way I could ever lose this game, and if I did, it would be really terrible and embarrassing. I feel pretty good about this, and yeah. <laughs> so I, I, I'm, a, I'm, I'm in, a, I'm in a boat similar to yours. Not as deflating as the six-two. There is no chance. Just a, huh? <laughs> I mean, but it, you won your first. Like your your week one battle was awesome. Just like getting like shell smash with Volbeat and finishing off yep. the Ludicolo with X Scissor. That was awesome. Yep. But yep. like. Mine was just like, it, it, it wasn't like a, it wasn't like a, cr something crazy happened, oh my, like last second I lose, you know? Mm -hmm. Like it wasn't like something crazy, like, you know, like the only way you lose is if you get like a self-killing move and then you get it. Right. It was like, okay, I have a massive lead. Oh God. And like, as time went on, I'm like, oh God, I'm gonna like, it, it was, it slipped out of my fingers over time. And yeah. that was like, I don't know if that like made me like I don't know if that was worse or if that was better. It was just like I think it was worse because it was like a slow descent to madness rather than like a aha 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 aha. aha, aha. Yeah, it was because <laughs> that was mine. Yeah, <laughs> it, mine was, was it was just like a, it, was... I, it, was, it was like I need just something to like finish this thing off. Uh, yeah. Like and I and I didn't get it in time, you know. And yeah. like he oh, yeah. did get a self-killing move, but it was Lunar Dance with his last Pokemon, which is like so it doesn't work. And it's like I was got so excited because I thought I had won it, and then I, it failed, and I didn't. And I'm just yeah, and then you're like, like Wait. super depressed as a result. <laughs> yeah. You know, it's just like it sucks being the only one who hasn't won something. I know it's only one. It's only two weeks into the season. It's like it's Metronome, so it's all chance. But like, I want to win something, John. <laughs> I hate to lose. I <laughs> I think when it comes to leagues and losing, I'm very desensitized because my favorite sports team I've, I've rooted for, when they went nine and seven, it was maybe like the best period of my life. I was so happy. I'm like, sports fans can be happy half of the time? No. Take it back, world. I didn't know this was a thing. <laughs> I thought we were supposed to be sad 14 weeks and two times we get a pity win. <laughs> I mean, that might I... be that might be me this, this season. <laughs> Yeah, it's, it, it did, but you get playoffs. <laughs> I mean, that's I, true. That's true. You know, like I, I've said many times, hey, even if we win every single game, we still get to go to playoffs and we still have a chance to win it. But could you imagine if we lost every single regular season game, go to playoffs and then just lose immediately and that's it? That's over. I don't win a single game in the that, league that I tough. created. If I if if I don't lose, if I don't win a single game. If we do this Metronome League again, I'm rebranding. The Houston Gastros are dead because clearly they're a garbage team. <laughs> See, like the, the fun, like the the thing that stinks about that is that you didn't win anything if that happened. But like the fun thing that you can take with it is like since it is random, it's not like your trash, and you can make it a fun story, like a fun, you know what I mean? Like a all right, Houston Gastros. We need a whole other thing. I mean, Dan has like 20 different team names. <laughs> I think he has three, but okay. <laughs> No, but you, you know what I mean. It, it rebranding can be fun. Getting a getting a whole little story going on. Yeah, I mean, like I I think like 
I mean, I think it'd be incredible if I lost every single regular season game and then won the entire league. Like, that, that would, would be, be amazing. Awesome. I but had I, a hard time But also, that. like, that's terrifying because it's like that first playoff game, the pressure's going to be on because it's like, I want to win once. <laughs> yeah. You Well, that, that's the thing. Like, it's... Like whenever I do a draft league season, like the the real ones, like with the you know you have to try and stuff. Ew, yucky. But you, what, until you, you get that me first not win, not trying in the Metrodome Battle Federation, John. How dare well, you? I'm <laughs> <laughs> but you know, like until you get that first win, it, the first win is the hardest win to get. And once you get that, all pressure is off. Until you get that, it's it's stressful. Yeah. So I I definitely understand what you're what you're saying. Ooh, nice. Oh, oh, Pokemon. I mean, like, the thing with Pokemon is taking it seriously ever beyond just having fun is a stupid idea. Like, the, the last time I may... T well, I mean, I, I say that. I'm too competitive not to take things seriously. But, like, in my GBA season, I had a great season. I went 9-3 and three first round. Th there's two reasons I lost. The first reason is my opponent made a, a fantastic mid-season addition, which was a Pokemon that absolutely demolishes my team. So it's like, well... Okay, that's, <laughs> that's that's tough. I don't. You hate to see it, but you know. Okay. Side note, because this is I I can talk about this here. I wasn't gonna complain the battle because it is what it is. But so if you guys don't know, it doesn't even matter if you matter. I'm just gonna. We're waiting till we get to the gym. We're talking about random things. So I created the GBA drafting system. Like that was that was all me for a variety of reasons. I made it the way it was. And one of the reasons, like, one of the things with it is, you won't, like, all the best tier 1 Pokemon won't be drafted, and that's fine, because people want variety, they want to see some of the lesser things used. But since so many of the broken best things won't get drafted, you can never make a mid-season acquisition, because if you make a mid-season acquisition and take one of these amazing Pokemon that wasn't drafted, you can completely, halfway through the season, alter your team so that you can do better against specific playoff teams and have an unfair advantage. And whether or not my opponent did that doesn't matter. I made a draft, like, a tiering system specifically so one could not do that, and then to immediately, like, have it come back and bite me seasons later as it's, like, changed a little bit, it's like, man, this is butts. No John, one this is, to this, me. Is, this might be one of the most depressing episodes we've ever recorded. <laughs> Mike, we gotta, we gotta get out of the system, you know? I mean, it's just, we're, we're both, we're talking about, we're, we're both just such losers. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey now, hey now. I I did go nine and three bef until I became before I became a loser. Let me come on. But you didn't now, win. Like, come on, man. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you gotta you gotta you gotta take a you know you gotta take a little bit of a, a positive light because it's the whole my whole point is it's Pokemon. What are you gonna do? Like, and the game came down. Allow so it to overcome your entire life and drastically affect you for days if you lose. Well, I mean, this is our job, so I guess that's kind of what we signed up for, unfortunately. But yeah. <laughs> you know, as I've said before, you win some, you lose some. <laughs> but, like, at the end of the day, like, my battle came down to whether or not I got a damage roll, or, like, if he got a damage roll or not, and then if I got a damage roll or not. And, like, when you really look into, like, Pokemon moves, and it's like, this move had a chance to do, like, with, like, 20 damage points one way or the other, and it's just down to... RNG, like there's nothing I can do beyond click the move. Mm -hmm. Like, who's the better battler? The guy that got the roll or the guy that didn't? Hey, I, I, both people played great. One person just gets the win and one person doesn't. It doesn't really, it doesn't say anything. And then you just kind of move on and one person moves on and one person doesn't. Yeah. So what I'm saying, kiddies, don't play Pokemon seriously. <laughs> play it for fun. All right, Garchomp just decided to memento. So that's fantastic. As soon as you said that, um, my Piloswine got crit, sacred, fire, burned, death. So Yikes. <laughs> that was, uh, was a tough, tough scene for the, the job. Oh, man. Dalkia again. definitely, like, avenged my, uh, it, it avenged Garchomp because it immediately came in and uh, sludge waved the Lombre and just knocked it into next week. Just booty slapped him. Booty slapped it? Yeah. <laughs> what the booty is going on? <laughs> Just at, he says that with, like, fury in his voice. What the booty is going on? <laughs> Death. This this gym puzzle is so long. Well, that's, I mean, that's the, the big reason I was just talking, because I was not bored, but also, like, I really want to get to the gym battle, because this that will be the exciting, like, 
crazy part, but for now it's like, okay, well... I, 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 have, a, I have a song in my heart. I need to let it free. <laughs> uh, Ugh. I just like, dude, I want to sell Houston Castro's MBF Season 1 Champions shirts. But I can't <laughs> unless I actually... See, I think it. that was the problem. I think you've gotten your heart too set on that exact thing. That yeah! The two losses. <laughs> You're like, man, I have no chance, and it's like, I mean, you could still, I don't, I, this won't affect whether or not you win at all. And it's hard to think that, because no matter what happens now, it only matters in that final playoff game. Also, I, out of curiosity, this is something I could probably ask anyway, any time, but are like, the two highest seeds, do they get a buy? Like, how are we yeah, doing that? that yeah, yeah, so okay, okay. three seed plays six, four plays mm -hmm. five, top two seeds get one, or get okay, a buy. Yeah. All right, cool. Smack down. Okay. So, essentially, like, you know, you want to win regular season games for the sake of being the one or two seed, but whether you're the three or four seed doesn't matter as much, you know? No. Yeah. Or the five or six, you know? So it's like... Or 15. I mean, I think, I think my hopes of being the one or two seed are already gone. <laughs> I mean, it is like, all I... random chance, so like, if you told me everyone ended up 3-3, three and three, I don't think that surprised me too much. Well, there's only five games. Oh. Oh yeah, that's how that works. Yeah. Well, maybe not 3-3. Three and 3-2? Three. <laughs> three <and two? laughs> Would that even be possible? Everyone's 2-3. and three. <laughs> It's it's not possible. Is that possible? It'd be complicated so. to figure it out. <laughs> I mean, yeah, at this point, like, my best pot... Like, the only person who still has hopes of going undefeated is Alex. And I have a chance to, like... If I win out, I go 3-2. and two. So, like, maybe 3-2 and two with a good enough differential could get second place. But I'd have to win every single one of the last, you know, last three of my games. Which is seems unlikely, considering I haven't won a single one. Because Celebi carries the team, but when Celebi eventually falls... The rest of the team just decides to poop the bed. What's the rest of your team? So it's Celebi, mm -hmm. Dusk Noir. Okay. Um, who Dusk Noir is definitely the second best Pokemon, but he's right. been crippled the last couple weeks by status conditions. Um, like the first week he was burned. Yeah. And so he just like he didn't he didn't have like a chance. Slowly to really withered. Pull. Yeah, because it's like Dusk Noir is very bulky, but he doesn't hit hard. So the problem right. with that is that if he gets like a status condition inflicted, he he you know he has a time limit you know. Right. Um, in addition, it didn't end up coming into play this week, but he got his um, his uh, Lepaberry was incinerated. Oh wow. Yeah. So I was like, all right, like he was the last one I sent in. He had eight turns to KO the Mill Tank, but he died to poison and Mill Tank's attacks. Uh, before he even had the chance. Wow. Um, I mean, he's got pressure, but that, like, only, like, helps a little bit. Yeah. Uh, but, like, you know, and then, like, Ursa Ring, I've, like, successfully activated Guts two weeks in a row, but then he doesn't get any <laughs> physical moves. Like, you know, Primate doesn't, like, you know, he gets some... Oh, God. Oh, man. All right. I just got rock record by an Ursa Ring. I shouldn't have been bad-mouthing Ursa Ring while it was on the field. <laughs> of course, that it is gets actually a four times super effective. <laughs> it was a rock record on my Ho-Oh. <laughs> so, this thing has... This thing, this thing has guts. I can... Yep, this, this is an Ursa Ring that its guts activated and got a four times... That's... That's freaking poetic. I hate life, John. <laughs> <laughs> You're just getting all of the bad luck out of your system, and you're ready to go on this crate. Like, you're gonna lose every one of these games, but you're gonna, like, walk into a store and be like, eh, why not get a scratch ticket? And it's gonna be like, you've won a million dollars! Wow. <laughs> but yeah, um, Alakazam has been decent. It's just, you know, he doesn't get special moves as much as I yeah. would like. Um, Hitmonchan hasn't done anything. Primate's done nothing. I think that's everyone. Yeah. I mean, I keep wanting, like, Primate to, like, 
ha get defiant and then just like crush people, but that is yet to occur. <laughs> that would be that would be wild. There's a lot of times I'll see like I tail glow dead. Oh, man. <laughs> yeah, I know what you mean. <gasps> Ooh, I'm I mean... getting my metagross finally. Oh, nice. Took a bit, but I did it. Yeah, I mean so, Celebi yeah, it, is it's... Celebi is. You gotta be kidding me, dude. Lunar dance. I've had four We're... freaking deaths this episode. Now we're just trading bad luck back and forth. Yeah, we are. Because you were plus three last episode, and I think I'm plus three this episode when it comes to, like, differential-wise. Or, you know what I'm saying. You've had one death, and I've had four this episode, right? right? so, like, yeah, yeah. So the two episodes have canceled each other out at this point. All right, okay. I need to... I'm pretty sure that was the last trainer before the gym leader, though, so I need to leave and then run through this entire puzzle again. Yeah, I'm not going to run through the puzzle again. It might hurt me, but I just, I refuse. I'm running past him and just like, oh, hey, hey, uh, Drayden, I need that warp panel behind you. <laughs> uh, I'll be back in like two minutes. Just Wait, can you, can you panel to him or no? So you can't panel to him, but like, you can panel out. You know, there's a okay. warp panel behind him. Once you get to him, that'll take you back to the entrance. But you have to. Yeah. You have to do that. Okay. Do that. Yep. Okay. So then, when does when does Duosion evolve? I think 41, 42, 43, somewhere. It's early 40s. I'm pretty. 41. sure. 41. Okay. So that'll be happening very soon. So I'll put my my experience share on that guy. <clears throat> But yeah, my team is like, I, I don't know if it's like the other ones haven't done anything just because they've got, they've not gotten lucky, but like Celebi has been carrying the team like easily, you know? Like Celebi has not only been able to like live everything, but it also is just getting the right moves, you know? Like even when it, it the Celebi got pluck with like, it, it, it got pluck when it had one metronome like left. Oh, wow. Oh, that was the wrong thing to do. Oops. I messed up the puzzle. Uh, yeah, so he, I was like, I freaked out with that because it's like, it can live even longer and it only ended up surviving for a few more turns because it was already yeah. like low and had like healed back up to full like four times already. <laughs> but once Celebi went down and the toxic spikes, the toxic spikes were brutal. Yeah, toxic spikes is, that. Like, that's just, I need to go heal. I don't even know how to do this puzzle anyways. <laughs> Wait, yeah, I'm, I'm like, brain farting so hard right now. I've just been, like, doing the same thing over and over again. Like, what? Yeah, I just need I'm, to like, go back. like, lifting its hand and then, like, lowering its hand, and it's like, what? Oh, yeah, I need I, to go I, up it after I turn it to the left. I didn't realize that connected. Oops. I'm being stupid. Yeah, I know. I remember I'm, this I'm dwelling on. Being... I'm dwelling on past pain, John. <laughs> well, this puzzle, like, for me at least, maybe I'm a stupid face, but, like, this is always the one that just takes forever. Like, it's... It's a nice puzzle, it's just one of those things that's not, like, great LP-wise, because it's like, oh, I gotta, like, figure out this long puzzle and there's a ton of trainers. Yeah, I know what you mean. It's taken us 24 minutes. Like... Right. Yeah, that's why I was throwing out random stories of... I mean, no, times. I think it's good. I mean, people love it when we tell stories. It, it, stories. Like, it's times like these when Let's Plays become podcasts. You yeah, right? Which... Is, is fun. Pod yeah, no, and it's, like, I think LPs like this have what convinced me that at some point I want to do a podcast, because it's it's just, well, I also talk too long anyways all the time, so that's... Yeah, I know what you mean. <laughs> I just, you know, as people would say, I have a gift for Gab, which is... <laughs> Yo, Gabba Gabba. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> I... I I think I kind of maybe know what I'm doing sometimes. You think you kind of maybe know what you're doing sometimes? It's John. I don't know if that's true though. I think I might have lied. I don't think I have any idea what I'm doing. Okay. So. Nope, not what I do. Okay. I like the thing is too. Is there so much backseat gaming when this happens? And I, I, I don't blame them, just the people that know this puzzle, like the back of their hand, because this is their first game and they've just played it so many times. Like, no, you come on. Yeah. It's like, sorry, man. 
But we don't have to listen to them because we're not doing this on stream. <laughs> it's very true. We, we could just sit here, you know, making mistakes, doing it in blissful ignorance. <laughs> I'm not ignorant of how bad I am, but uh, <laughs> I don't have to listen okay, to them. Okay, fair enough. <laughs> At some point, I very much want to do a speedrun of a Gen 1 game just because of how truly bad I am at... Not the games, <laughs> but just I'm so slow, and I don't remember anything ever. Yeah, I know what you mean. People are like, oh, how don't you remember? You've played these games a million times. It's like, yeah, but every time I flounder around and have no idea what I'm doing. <laughs> so I never learned the path, because I've never, like, I've never tried to do it in a way that was smart. I just go everywhere possible a hundred times in a row. Yeah. All right, it is time to do the, the, the gym battle. We're gonna lead with uh, Dalkia dragons punching each other in the face. Okay, I do I know what I'm doing? I don't know if I know what I'm doing. Ugh. Drayden's or Mallory's beard is ridiculous. <laughs> a weasel. Mike, I have a really, really bad feeling. I have no idea what I'm. <gasps> I did it. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> you freaked me out with that gasp. <laughs> Alright. Victory is mine! Ugh. Oh, Iris. Chloe, that's the name of my puppy. Cute. Oh, Chloe. Okay. That's you, Don. Oh, I'm tail slapping this weasel. Oh, yeah. No speeding up in the gym battles, John. Wait, what? I've been okay. speeding up. <laughs> Wait, why are we not allowed to speed up in the gym battles? That might just be something I made up. I've and literally I... sped up every single gym battle. Every time we touch, I speed eat up, yeah. Do, 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 All right, well, Drayden's wasting his hyper potions on a weasel that I've burned, so that's fine. I would much rather him use that on a weasel than something that's tougher to kill. It's very fair. All right, so, okay, so blood, I just got so, wait, what, what just happened there? So, I am learning something unfortunate where I sped up. Okay. So, I got stuck in a rollout, but then it put me to sleep, and then it went for Dark Pulse, and I was stuck in where I pressed A too many times. I don't really know which. It was a whole thing. So, so I almost lost one, life? but I didn't. You almost did. Yeah. Oh, man. I burned the Masharna, but it synchronized, and now I'm burned. I nine. I nine. <laughs> I don't know if I've ever heard you make a sound like that, John. That was awesome. Uh, I, I do that quite often. Pretty sure I got it for myself. Or no, a uh, family guy character. What is a wonder room? Oh, defense and special defense are swat. So now this... Recover's not helpful if I have four... Oh, I went for torment. Gosh, no. Wait. So if torment? you switch no. out, torment goes away. Oh, okay, okay, okay. It's... But torment, like, you can use the move every other turn, too, right? Correct. Yeah, okay. Alright, his last Pokemon is a Clefairy. He had a Buizel, Masharna, and Clefairy. And I got Rock Smash. Oh, that did, did less than I thought. It was super... Oh, well, it is three levels higher. I'm doing that thing where you battle a Bastiodon, and then you can't kill it because it's a Bastiodon. I mean, if you get one grounder fighting move... I mean, this is true, but I, I have not, and it just got ah. Wish. Of course it did. It just what? It got Wish. Oh, fantastic. I killed it! Oh, oh nice! God. Oof. Oh, that's Good so wag Hmm, Burberry. My gosh. Uh, Yondu. You have not been good. I get myself a second legendary, and it's just been absolutely trash. Oh, Verizian? Yeah. Oh, well. That is amusing to me, John. Yeah, it's been like one of my worst. I just got belly drummed this thing. It's definitely gonna get O code now that belly drummed and have no HP. Oh, Graf's not, thank gosh. Aw, okay. oh, man, dude. Giratina, what are you doing? Don't pain split when this thing is almost dead. Oh, Giratina. You cheeky guy, you. Okay, you just need one physical move and you will Oko anything. You're at plus six and you're uh, a Verizion. Alright, Hydro Pump is not what I was hoping for, but it's not a terrible move, so I can't complain too much. Giratina whipping up a whirlwind. Whipping up a whirlwind, yeah. Raise a wind, sing sing. Ah, that, wow, that did very little. 
Crush grip me all you want, Clefairy, with your tiny little hands. How did that not KO? Come on, Ren. Small hands. Return. Okay, it's dead. We have defeated the final gym leader! Huzzah! Huzzah! Look at that. Tail glow is not what I wanted to see. Who got tail glow? Seedra. Oh. oh. I still haven't gotten one physical move since I belly drummed, and it's it's definitely upsetting me. Understandably. I mean, I, that happened in my battle too. Like, my, my Ursa Ring was already, like, boosted because of guts and was losing HP fast due to poison, and then decides to belly drum. I, which, I don't want to cut which, you off, like, but down... I just got, a, I put the Seedra asleep and then got Nightmare immediately. Wow. That's awesome. That's crazy. Now, it lived with one HP, and that's not fun, but, you know. <laughs> Professor Juniper just gave me a mask one. it's like, oh. Yes, I didn't already have any of these. Thanks. But yeah, freaking Ursa Ring gets poison, so that gets the gust, guts boost, but then it belly drums. So while maxing its attack is great, it never got a chance to do anything with it because it then, like, the belly drum got it low enough to where, like, poison plus a hit from the opponent killed it. <laughs> yeah, not not great. Not so fun. that was, that was, man, that was a brutal, brutal match. <laughs> I'm like, I'm talking about it so much because at the time of filming this, it only happened two days ago. People are seeing it like three days after the fact. But after it's been posted, but man, screw you, our guardian and your stupid meal tank. Mike, I'm so upset. What happened? My Frizion never got a physical move. I got it, the Seedra down to what looked like one HP. It got healed up. Found a way to turn my type into water, then got two water moves in a row, ending with a tail glowed up leaf storm. So I very much lost a life because Vrizion never can do anything. <laughs> Yikes. Um, oh my God. Mis ocios, senor. I'm uh, angrily using my now level 45 Metagross because I don't care anymore. Do it. Metagross Splash. is awesome. Dude, I have a Metagross in Pokemon Go and I love it. It's like not fantastic, but like every time I get enough Stardust to power it up, I do. Now I really, I, I'm far away from one, but man, do I want one. I got really lucky. I hatched two Beldum eggs in a row during the double candy event. And it like, I, I had 70 Beldum candy and then hatching one jumped me up to 130. And then I hatched another one and got me up to like 190. So it's like I had enough to evolve my 93 IV Beldum into a Metagross. And I have plenty of candy to power it up. I'm just limited by Stardust, unfortunately. Yeah. I had the same thing happen to me in a similar event way back in the day with Dragonite. Mm. And it was amazing. It was like, you get more candy when you open eggs and all these things were going on. So I kept getting these 10k, like, Dratinis, which resulted in my 98% one. And I had so much candy, and I was like, this is the greatest thing that's ever happened. Yeah, I know what you mean. All right, so I did finally beat Lei Jim. All right, well, we can probably wrap it up then because there's just a little bit of cut scenes with like Juniper and she gives you like the Master Ball, which we clearly don't need. Um, shh, don't say that. They don't know we have Master Balls. Shh, 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 shh. We're just trying to pretend that we haven't gotten Master Balls in this game. Shh. Uh, yeah, we didn't hack this game at all. Um, <laughs> anyways, guys, that is going to wrap it up for this episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. Next episode is going to be over on Pokemon's channel. Make sure you subscribe to him if you're not already, which would kind of be ridiculous if you've been watching this entire series and you're not already subscribed to him. Um, but thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like. Make sure you answer the comment question. And that is all we have for now. So until next time, big fans. Gotta catch them all.